An autopsy conducted on the body of 29-year-old Joseph Nyakundi, the son of city lawyer Asa Nyakundi, suggests that the person who shot him might have done it from outside the vehicle. This sharply contrasts with what his father, Nyakundi Kibagendi, reported to police on Sunday, that he accidentally shot his son while holstering his gun. And as Chim Taigwen now reports, the probe has been taken over by homicide detectives. A preliminary investigation forwarded to the Director of Criminal Investigations, George Kinoti, has introduced a twist into the mysterious death of Joseph Nyakundi, the son of lawyer Asa Nyakundi. The report suggests that Nyakunde's son was shot from outside the car, given the trajectory of the bullet head after piercing through his ribcage. Further analysis from the autopsy conducted in the presence of ballistics and homicide detectives revealed there might have been a confrontation before the bullet was discharged from Nyakunde's gun. The chief government pathologist Johan Senodor led autopsy places hemorrhage or excessive bleeding as the cause of death. His lung was also ruptured. Detectives say further analysis of the injury reveals the possibility of a confrontation between Joseph Nyakundi and his shooter, who at the point of shooting him was standing outside the rear back right door of the Toyota Axio Motor Vehicle Registration number KCE753B. He was riding in driven by his father. Ballistic experts, including government pathologist Dr. Johansen Oduo, re-examined the vehicle Thursday and are yet to finalize their report. A search conducted in the house of the criminal lawyer Tuesday had some shocking revelations. In a safe in the master bedroom was a pistol and 471 rounds of ammunition of different caliber, while in an adjacent room used as a library. On the shoe rack was another shotgun. Yakundi's Glock pistol, which was recovered from him after the fatal shooting, was confirmed to be loaded with 13 rounds of ammunition. A spent cartridge was also recovered from the boot of the vehicle. The city lawyer claims to have accidentally shot his son on the chest while holstering his gun as they drove home from church last Sunday. Chemutai Goin, Citizen TV.